Man, this t-shirt makes me look like a gay stripper. Hey guys, how's it going? You know what really annoys me? Huh? Lectures. <laughs> no, 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 not the lectures themselves, or the lecturers that are giving the lesson, because lectures actually make me smart. It's the dumbasses in the lectures that make me dumb. So for those who don't know what a lecture is, um, it's basically where you sit in a room or a lecture hall and there's a lecturer and they basically tell you stuff about the topic that you're talking about, whether it be information, whether it be what to study for, whether it be just information pretty much about what you're doing. Hey. But some people in lectures don't understand the concept of shutting up and listening. Here are the five things that I hate about lectures and the five things that I like about lectures. Number one. The first thing you need to do when it comes to lectures is actually rock up on time. And you should know what time is because they taught you that in the first grade. And if you don't know, it's also common courtesy to rock up on time when you're supposed to be there on time. I don't mean the ones that like rock up five minutes late. I'm talking about the ones that rock up halfway through the lecture. Whether it be an hour lecture, you rock up half an hour late. Or whether it be a two hour lecture and you rock up an hour late. You guys need to get your sh** together. And trust me, it does happen. What's the point? Like, seriously, come on. You guys rock up to a lecture halfway through? That's like, you know, you're only gonna learn half the content, so that's like, you know, trying to eat without a mouth. I mean, you got the digestive system and stuff, but you just can't eat it because you got no mouth to put it in. You ain't got no entry point, fool. Number P. Now, in lectures, you're allowed to have either, you know, you're allowed to bring in laptops or you're allowed to bring in books and pens, but um, most of the time, people who bring in laptops, AKA me, tend to be a little bit noisy. You know what I mean? Noisy as in... I mean noisy as in they type on their damn keyboard like it's a damn battlefield. Are you typing on the keyboard like your whole life depend on it? Who you think you are, Bill Gates? Who you think you are, Steve Jobs? Who you think you are, Batman? Give it down, you little kid! Yeah, 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 yeah! Number three! People who like to eat during lectures, and I mean, not just eat, like I mean crumble up their wrappers like, like they're starting a damn beatbox. Number four! People who talk behind you during a lecture. And I don't mean people who just, you know, whisper or talk. You know, in the voices that put babies to sleep like I do. I mean people that talk like they're at a damn rave party. Damn! To go off from that, people who speak in a different language behind you. That you can't even understand. Speaking like, you know, they're selling something at a black market. Keep your voice down. Your family in Asia can't hear you. So there's no point talking. I'm being really black in this video, I don't even know why. Allows me to be angry. Number five. Um, basically people who sit on the end of a row. And I'm not talking about the end that, you know, is at the end. I'm talking about the end that people enter. You got the whole row to fill up and you start from the very beginning. What's wrong with you? People are trying to get past. They gotta, they gotta get past your fat leg. Unless you got skinny legs, then that's okay. It's okay, girl. But damn, you need to move out of the way. Otherwise, you know, you're gonna cause problems. People, you're causing traffic. You're causing traffic jam. Well, there, there's not supposed to be a traffic jam. Oh, damn, I'm so black. Well, there goes my five that I hate. But there are five things that I do like about lectures, so let's get to that. Number six. People who play games during a lecture. And I mean, like, you know, I love you guys. I play games during a lecture. But, I mean, seriously, if, if you're playing Tetris, that, that's entertaining. If the lecture is, like, boring as hell, then, yeah, like... And if you pass Tetris, then you know who you're gonna have lunch with after the lecture. Me! Number seven. People who rock up at the wrong lecture. You, my friend, amuse me. It's only stupid on your behalf because you're an idiot. But for me, that's funny. <laughs> it's classic walking into a lecture like you a boss. And then you realize that it's the wrong lecture and then you pretty much walk out. Walk of shame. Oh, hold on, I'm in the wrong class. This is an aviation. <laughs> I'm not smart enough to study aviation. Well, obviously, because you're in the wrong lecture hall. Eight. Lecturers who are fun and amusing. It's because they make lectures fun. If you're a lecturer that's watching this, which I highly doubt you will, but if you are and you give lectures, be fun and entertaining because people are gonna love you and they're gonna most likely rock up to the lecture even though the topic is totally boring. Number nine. The fact that lectures actually exist. Like the fact that you can, you know, you don't, it's not a class that you're compulsory. Like it's not compulsory. You don't have to be compulsory. You can rock up whenever you want. You can go to it. Or you can choose not to, you can go halfway through, you can leave halfway through like those dumbasses that don't know what's going on. Mm -mm. Most likely they're going to chuck on the stuff that you've learned in the lecture or the stuff that you didn't even know in the lecture onto the internet. So you can check that out without having to even rock up, which is cool. And my last thing that I like about lectures is what people do during the lecture. And I mean my people who go on Facebook and all the meme websites and things like that. I like you, I got respect for you. The reason is because 
If I'm sitting behind you and I don't know your name, this is a tip, alright? By the way, this is a tip. If I'm sitting behind you and I don't know your name and you've talked to me before and I can't remember your name, I'm, I'm just gonna look at your Facebook profile name when you're on it. And I am gonna sound so sly. I, I play Tetris during my lectures, okay? I hope you like this video as much as I didn't like making it because it was boring. But either way, um, it's just the first video of many that I'm going to do about uni. And you will probably relate, you probably won't, you probably won't even care. But what else? I hope you like it. So check out my latest two videos here. And uh, be sure to subscribe, be sure to hit that like button, the favourite, the video. Um, spread the video, do what you can to, you know, make people aware of these things. Thank you for coming, that was all I had to give for the lecture. So many things with these glasses I can do.